For today's crafts video, we are going to be making a origami lotus flower. Now this is a very simple origami flower. It's um, it's just the same steps but repeating it over and over. And um, so yeah, this is my first origami video. And I know you, a lot of other people have uh, tutorials of this, but it's just the people that do origami tutorials don't talk. They just show it and they have um, like subtitles, but um, I read in the comments that some people don't get it because they're just showing you and they're not explaining it so um, I thought I should just um, do um, a video with explanations and that's actually how I learned origami too I, I started watching YouTube video first just get a piece of paper any type of paper a uh, printer paper would work I am using just construction paper um, I don't have uh, origami paper so this is what I'm using um, it works fine so um, let's just start so first you wanna have all four equal sides as you can see this is not because this is this side is longer than this side so we're gonna try to make it so first you start with taking one side and then just do this and then um, on the side you want to make it equal so just about like when it lines up I don't really know how to explain that it doesn't have to be perfect just there you go so so you just have to cut cut this part off and then this part will become um, all equal sides so just cut this side take any type of scissors it's not like the best type of cutting because you can get off and stuff but um, it works fine and this is a very easy piece so there you have it you make it so you have that one good thing about that is that you already have one of the folds so that that would be your first fold and then the second one would be open it up Go the other side and you see the fold here so you go the other way so you take this fold and sorry um put it up to here hope you can see that hold on there do that and then fold down like this there you go So now, on the inside, you have two lines. They're pretty visible. The first thing you want to do is take one of these corners and just fold it, bring it up to the middle and fold it down. Like that. I'll zoom in. Just like that. And then take the next corner and bring it up to the center and just fold. Center, vertex, um, midpoint. <laughs> all math words so see I didn't really cut mine straight so it doesn't line up you have a bit of space there but that doesn't matter I mean it would ma matter for um, other like more detailed type of origami but this is just a very easy one so don't have to be that detailed so there you go everybody have this it wasn't too bad right Okay, now we just do the same thing, but just do it with this side now. So same thing, bring it up. Yeah, this is like a five minute or less than a five minute origami, and it's a pretty flower. So, yeah, bring that up. You have this. Hope the glare isn't too bad. That's why I picked this type of paper. Because if you do it on white, you get more of a glare, I feel like. And it's harder to see. So there you go. And now, the next part, you flip it over and do the same thing. So take the side and bring it up to the midpoint, the center, or the vertex. <laughs> Actually, vertex means center, right? I think so. And this could get a little hard to get it to fold. Because regular paper is much thicker than origami paper. So it's nice to have origami paper, which I don't have any. I should really get some. And then, there you go. 
Okay, that's not really even, but that's okay. Okay, so this is what you should have right now. The next step is to flip it back around. Should have this. Now, you just take these little petals and just fold them back like that. Like so. I'm sure you guys are getting this. This is not hard. I got it on the first try. There you go. Here. This back is not very stable. But yeah, this is what you should have. And then, here, keep these open. Turn it back around on the other side. And we take these petals. Let me get a. Take this petal and then fold it up just about a little bit more than a half ways. So that's what you should have. And then do the same thing on all these fours. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't have to be equal either. Just equal as you can make it. Like so. And then take the next one. That. And then the last one. There you go. So oh, mine's all terribly creased. I don't know how that happened. Okay. So just once more, just fold it a little tighter. And then, one last step, turn it back around. All right, something like that. And then, last step is to take the inner petals and just fold them like you did with the others. There you go. Hold on, if my hand is blocking. Just like that, just take the inner petals, fold them up. Uh, hold on. And yeah, that is how your lotus flower is supposed to look like. Or almost. <laughs> there you go. See, it wasn't very hard.